So I saved $2,843.15 per month on my online business by switching to Go High Level. And in this video, I'm going to break down line by line how I saved all that money. So you're literally gonna see like how much every single tool uh, that I use in my business costs versus how much Go High Level costs for the same exact functionality. And I'm gonna tell you the pros and the cons because it's not all rainbows and butterflies. There are downsides to using Go High High level versus using all of those other tools. And then hopefully this will help you decide whether using Go High Level will be right for you and your business. Now, one thing I wanna say is I currently use both platforms. So I'm using a stack that includes ClickFunnels, ActiveCampaign, et cetera. And I have several different funnels that I'm using that stack in, but I transitioned one of my funnels all the way over to Go High Level. And I kinda did this as a test at first just to see if the numbers dropped or anything like that. And then now I'm gonna slowly start transitioning my other funnels over as well. And once I do that, I'm going to be saving even more money. So let's break down the previous software stack that I was using and the current software stack for some of my funnels still. And overall, I'm spending $2,940.15 every month on software for my business. And that's just for the funnel part. So text messaging, email marketing, funnels, CRM, appointment setting, document signing, project management, all of it. And this actually doesn't even include what my team pays for individually. So a lot of my team, for instance, is on the, you know, pro plan for chat GBT or the pro plan for Claude because AI is super useful. That doesn't even count any of that. So the biggest part of this that costs an absurd amount of money is active campaign. Active campaign costs me $1,577 a month. Okay. $1,577 a month. And by the way, this isn't even with their top tier plan. Now I have around 100,000 contacts, right? So 100,000 people on my various different email lists. And the price keeps going up as my list grows. Now, the second one that I pay for is close.com. And this is about $588 a month for seven users. Now, close.com is my CRM that I use for my high ticket coaching business. Now, I'll be honest, I really, like close, right? It's probably one of the best CRMs out there. And it's really good when it comes to following up with potential clients. With that being said, it's very expensive. Next is ClickFunnels. And this is $214.73 a month. Now I'm on their scale plan. And this is basically for funnel building and landing pages. So yeah, it's a great landing page software. It's a great funnel builder. I also absolutely love Russell Brunson. I think he's a great guy. But you know, it's pretty expensive. Next is ClickUp. Up, and it costs me $160 a month for 16 seats. Now that's my project management software for my team. My operations manager really likes ClickUp. I'm personally not that much of a fan, but it's starting to grow on me. Uh, and yeah, we decided to upgrade to ClickUp. We were using Asana before. We really liked Asana, or at least I really liked Asana. I think it's very easy to use. ClickUp is not as easy to use and it just doesn't seem as intuitive, but you can do more with it. So we decided to upgrade to it. Then we've got Typeform. Typeform is $100 and $7.92 a month. And this is for forms and surveys. Now, the important thing with Typeform, and this is really the reason why we use it, is that it integrates directly into paid ads funnels and it integrates with Calendly as well as whatever you're using for the funnel itself, for instance, ClickFunnels. So just to make this very clear, you have your ClickFunnels landing page and then you have a Typeform where it asks them questions and it qualifies them. And if they end up being qualified after it asks them questions, then the Calendly link actually pops up on the same exact page. So there's no in-between steps. And this is really important because whenever you try to load another page, if there's an in-between step, there's a massive drop-off. Okay, so we have all three of those uh, integrated in one, ClickFunnels, Calendly and Typeform. And this is especially important to have if you have a paid ads funnel. And then of course, DocuSign. This is for signing contracts and it costs $90 a month for freaking document signing and contracts. The $79, just to be clear here, guys, was from last year. Uh, I'm calling my operations manager right now to figure out how much we actually paid last month for Zapier because it ranges. Some months it's higher, some months it's lower. So Kat, how much did we pay last month for Zapier? It was $411. $411, guys. So yeah, you heard it. 
You heard it right there. $411. We're just going to keep the numbers from last year though, right? But yeah, $411 last month for Zapier. And basically Zapier just connects everything together. And the problem with connecting everything together with Zapier is it breaks a lot. When it breaks, there's, there's not really that much you can do. It just breaks. It just doesn't work and it sucks to suck, right? And when we started using like different funnels and, and new zaps and that kind of thing, that's when the Zapier cost just went out of control. So keep in mind, Zapier cost, it's over $400 a month now, but we're just going to say $79 just to be nice because that was the cost last year. Next is Taplio at $65. And this is for like LinkedIn automation. I think we actually use another one for Twitter as well. I, I think it's Tweet Hunter. I, I forgot. But basically, it's just the ability to schedule your tweets or schedule your LinkedIn posts. Uh, and then Airtable at $24 for databases. And then Short.io at $18 for link shortening and Calendly at $16 for appointment booking. And honestly, there's other ones on top of that, but I'm just basically trying to show more of a fair comparison. Uh, for instance, there's Twilio. That's like a text messaging software, but we kind of don't use it. We've been signed up to it, but we kind of haven't really used it as much as we should have been. And so I didn't really include that in the total amount. With that being said, Go High Level does have a very good text messaging component to it. So that other one wouldn't be needed at all if I completely switched over. But anyways, all this adds up to $2,940.15 every single month. And the crazy part is half of these tools don't even talk to each other properly. So for instance, I have short.io to collect the data, but it doesn't really read the data at all. In fact, the data is extremely convoluted um, and you actually have to spend a lot of time actually reading it just to figure out anything with the data. I also am signed up to Hyros. Um, I will not be replacing it because Hy Hyros is like pretty good and it does some stuff that none of the other ones really do. Um, but yeah, I have like a backup when it comes to the data with Hyros. And yeah, half of these tools don't talk to each other properly. And it's just a huge pain in the butt. Right. So recently I was looking at DocuSign and there were some features we really didn't like, right? The interface felt clunky and we were paying $90 a month for something that we barely used. And that's when I discovered that Go High Level has their own version of DocuSign built right in. And think about this for a second. DocuSign costs $99 a month. It's for signing contracts. It's, it's literally like a PDF contract signing software that just shares it with people via email. That's all it does. Like, I can't believe that's not like $10 a month, right? It's $99 a month. And Go High Level on their own costs $97 a month. So Go High Level costs less than just my document signing software. And you get just about all of the things that I just mentioned you get with Go High Level. And the data is all in one and it's not convoluted, right? So you don't have to use Zaps to string a bunch of stuff together. It's all on the same platform and all of the data is together. Cause So you can have more of a holistic view of what's happening in your business. So I started digging deeper and what I found blew my mind. For $97 a month, you get everything and I mean everything. And by the way, if you wanna check out Go High Level and see all the features they have, cause there's some stuff that I probably don't even use, go ahead and click the link in the description in the pin comment below, you'll get one month free. So let's walk through what you actually get with Go High Level. First, you get sales funnels, just like ClickFunnels. Drag and drop editor is intuitive. There's tons of templates that convert really well. And what's really cool is I actually created my own templates that my students can use. So I created my own templates, put them on Go High Level, and my students can just use them at any time, which is awesome. And really, it's just as good as ClickFunnels for funnel building. You also get a full CRM. Now, is it as good as Close? Probably not, but it's way better than ClickFunnels basic CRM. And for most businesses, it's more than enough. Additionally, you get email marketing with advanced automation, and this could replace active campaign for most people. Now, the automation builder is visual and it's easy to use, and you get SMS marketing built right in. So there's no need for a separate tool. Now, is the email marketing as good as active campaign? Probably not. Active campaign is probably the best in class, but it's pretty freaking close. Now, when it comes to the SMS marketing, it actually is quite good. It's probably maybe it might actually be the best in class tool. And and additionally, you get appointment scheduling with a full calendar system, and this replaces Calendly completely. Plus, you get a website builder, not just landing pages, full websites with blogs and everything, and you get reputation management, right? So it monitors your online reviews and it helps you get more positive reviews. Plus, you get course creation, a full learning management system built in, uh, you get social media scheduling, you get form builders just like Typeform, you get document signing just like DocuSign, and here's the best part. Everything talks to each other. No Zapier needed. So when someone fills out a form, they automatically get added to your CRM and then they get tagged based on their responses and they get added to email sequences and they get booked for appointments. And all this can be combined with AI automatically 
without breaking. And this is the thing that separates it from any other platform. You simply cannot do this on any other platform. All the other solutions, you have to use Zapier to basically tape together a bunch of stuff and it just doesn't work. Like it breaks all the time. It's super convoluted. It's super hard to read the data. It's super hard to actually make any actionable decisions based on the data that you're collecting. Now you might be wondering if go high level is so good, why haven't I fully switched yet? Great question. And I want to be completely transparent here. First, I currently use ClickFunnels for my paid ads. And there's a specific reason for this. That combination that I talked about earlier, ClickFunnels, Typeform, and Calendly, currently that combination doesn't work as well with Go High Level, right? The Typeform, Calendly, and ClickFunnels has an amazing integration that probably boosts the effectiveness of paid ads by like 10 to 15%. And so I am sticking with it. With that being said, I've informed Go High Level about this, and hopefully they're going to switch pretty soon. Additionally, I really like Close as a CRM. It's probably the best CRM I've ever used, and specifically for a high ticket coaching business. So I'm really hesitant to switch to Go High Level CRM. With that being said, you can use everything else from Go High Level and then just not use the CRM. That's totally fine. Third, I have a full-time marketing person and a full-time IT person on my team, and they constantly monitor our automations to make sure everything works. And without this team, the ClickFunnels setup would be a nightmare. Zapier breaks all the time, integrations fail, data gets duplicated, but with my team managing it, it works well. However, if I were starting fresh today without a tech team, hands down, I would use Go High Level, not even a chance. And then also another thing is just simply the sunk cost fallacy. I've sunk hundreds, if not thousands of hours into all of these different software that I'm using, and I've gotten really good at using them. And so it's kind of hard to switch over to other software. So with that being said, my current monthly spending is actually much more than $2,940.15 per month. And the Go High Level starter plan is $97. So the monthly savings is $2,843.15. And the annual savings is $34,117.80. And 80 cents. But what's really crazy is most of you watching this probably don't even need all the tools I'm using. You probably don't need 16 ClickUp seats. You probably don't have 100,000 email contacts. So your savings could be even more dramatic. Let's say you're spending just $500 a month on various tools. You could still save over $4,000 a year by switching to go high level. And that's money that you could reinvest in your business and advertising and hiring and growth, etc. And one thing that's amazing about go high level, and this is one of the reasons why I decided to switch over to them and I decided to start recommending them to my students is the fact that their support is incredible. It used to be that when you have like 10 different tools, you would literally have to call all 10 different companies if something went wrong, right? Because the companies aren't working together. So if some zap didn't work, for instance, you'd have to call multiple different companies just to get it to work right, which is a huge headache. You'd end up spending half of your day on the phone with customer service and tech support. With Go High Level, they have 24 seven Zoom calls where you can just log into the Zoom call, tell them what your problem is, and then you can have someone literally literally tell you what to do looking at your screen or even take control of your screen with Zoom. They can literally take control of your screen and just fix the problem for you. So instead of spending time on the phone trying to describe what's on your screen and what's going on to somebody and then they tell you what to do and then they can't figure it out so they have to call somebody else and then call somebody else. It's just a massive nightmare and then they probably blame the other company and then you call the other company, they blame the original company, et cetera, et cetera. I'm sure we've all experienced this. You can literally just log into one platform, get on a Zoom call with really good tech professionals and they will literally tell you exactly what to do or even just control your screen and do it for you. Amazing. Their customer support is absolutely next level and it's one of my favorite things about them. So like I said, check out Go High Level down in the description in the pinned comment below. I would say the one type of person that it's probably not for, which is maybe like, I don't know, one to 2% of people watching this video is gonna be somebody who runs paid ads for a living and you need the absolute best in-class tools because you're competing against other people who run paid ads for a living and your margins are really thin, right? So if you're in a market where your margins are really thin, you run paid ads for a living, you know, you probably wanna use, for instance, ActiveCampaign as your, your email automation tool. You probably would continue to wanna use some sort of landing page software that integrates with Calendly and Typeform all at once and that kind of thing, right? But if you're literally anybody else that falls outside of that category, the ROI is just way better if you're using Go High Level. Because if you're spending like millions of dollars a month on ads, one or 2% better would actually result in tens of thousands or hundreds of thousands or maybe even millions of dollars in extra profit over a long period of time. But if you're not spending like millions of dollars a month on ads, then it doesn't really matter that much. And you should probably just save money and time and convenience by switching to one software that does it all. So again, guys, check it out down in the description. Uh, free month free from them. Highly recommend it. And watch this other video where I talk about Go High Level as well.